Hello everyone! It's me, Ash, and this is a brand new series. Not, I wouldn't say brand new. This is going to be season two of Feed the Beast. If you guys haven't watched my first ser series of Feed the Beast, uh, you can find it in the older. It's one of the older uh, series, one of the first series I started, and it's a predecessor of this series. And also, this series foregoes Yog Yogcraft, which is just like a slightly less fleshed out version of Feed the Beast Pack anyway. Um, but as you can see, it's a brand new world. We just sp spawned in, so I hope you guys are uh, ready to get crunk in the club. Because... And actually, I hope you're actually the opposite of ready to get crunk in the club. And you're ready to actually sit in your bedroom by yourself with your laptop or your personal computer maybe your your um, iPhone maybe your uh, if you're a real man or a real woman real lady your uh, Android uh, device and I hope you're ready to um, live a lonely solitude socialist life with me leading the way with my videos here on Edge Plays so if you're wondering this is the unleashed pack on the Feed the Beast launcher Feed the Beast Unleashed and I've got the Sortex uh, texture pack going on because I wanted to change. I wanted it to be different from the. Uh, I have y'all. I mean, I have Sfax on every series simply because it's the most um, supported. But because Feed the Beast is so popular, a lot of the other popular texture packs even have that. Even if they don't have the the third party support that say. Um, uh, Sfax does. So I decided, you know what, this is a perfect opportunity to get a break away from Sfax for at least one series and remind myself that I'm about to get absolutely murdered by the legions of undead that are undoubtedly shit. That's not what I wanted to do. That are undoubtedly going to murder me in my, uh, in my uh, epic attempt to try to build a house before nightfall that has already failed. So a good good way to start the series is to absolutely uh, fail off the, right off the bat. Where's my axe? Did I break it? I thought I had an axe, but I broke it already. Just all over, all over the wood. Okay. Shit. I didn't mean to make that, but I'm going to need it anyway, so. Alright, we got some sticks. So unfortunately, there's only a six... Oh, God damn it, I made two. There's only a 64... Bit, I almost made another one. There's only a 64-bit um pack for this. I usually use a 128, so it doesn't look quite as crisp as usual. But you take what you can get, you know. Okay, so <sighs> huge ass trees everywhere. Oh, we got an enemy over there. So I know where some coal is. I think there's some in here, maybe. So I'm immediately going to go get this coal, so we can make some torches. Oh, come on, baby. There we go. Not the fastest thing I've ever seen. Jeez. I can't really see the animation, the breaking animation, either. Maybe it's because I'm looking through the water. This isn't good. This isn't good. There we go. Underwater mining is not the... I Ill, Probably the most ill-advised form of mining. Okay. Okay, we got some. Now we can just go ahead and make some and put them up in here. I'm going to make one. Boom. Okay, let's go immediately for you guys. Pop this baby up. Boosh. Okay. Awesome. Now we can see. You guys can see. Everyone's got a vision. We can discuss our first and our first few plans, okay? Because in Yawncraft, it might as well have been called Thomcraft series, you know? Because that's pretty much all we did was Thomcraft. Um, so we're gonna try to avoid that to start to make it different, you know? Uh, maybe we can't mine this. I think we just destroyed it. I don't know what that is. Maybe it's iron. Is that iron? I don't know. Um. Okay. 
Alright, so we've got some iron, maybe. Is it iron? It looks to be iron. We're going to need to make some stone tools. So let's go ahead and mine some stone up. Now, back to back to discussing our 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 mission. The first few steps are going to be obvious, you know. You got to get um you got to get a base set up, which is what we're working on now. We got to get some tools, which we're also working on. I've already got a little bit of wood, but we've we've already run out of wood. So, um, we're going to go chop down some more trees. No, we don't want to do that one. And then we want to get rubber trees and make a rubber tree farm. The question we have to ask ourselves is what's what part of the Feed the Beast mod pack do we want to concentrate on? Since we're not going to be working on Thomcraft, since we have a whole other series that did that for like 15 episodes or 20 episodes or something. And, hmm, it's a tough one, you know? I mean, you got the obvious stuff. We need to make a macerator. We need to make a quarry. We need to make a power station. I, I think we want to put a lot of work into power station first, because using engines and stuff is is not the best. In fact, it's, it's the opposite of the best. Okay, so we got plenty of uh, cobblestone, which actually looks pretty freaking good in this mod pack. So maybe we should just use this pickaxe up until we get a bunch of uh, cobblestone and it breaks. And maybe we'll start making our walls out of the cobblestone and seeing how they look. Because the cobblestone looks pretty sweet. It looks like uh, brick walls without actually having to turn it into brick. Look at this, a cure sapling. We definitely want a pink tree, so that's good. Holy shit, we actually got... How the hell did we get rubber saplings? Did we turn some rubber wood into planks accidentally? I have no idea how we got these three rubber saplings, but damn, perfect, actually. Okay. So, I haven't played an actual Feed the Beast mod pack in a while, uh, if you discount the our time in Yogcraft. So I don't really know what a lot of the, um, firstly, let's make a sword before we continue this, because I don't feel safe. Alright, we're going to make a stone sword. Oh, look at that thing. It looks freaking nice. Oh, shit. Alright, and uh, we're going to chop this and this. Okay. Now, we need to start putting our cobblestone down. I don't think we're gonna fill the corners in. I want to put like logs in the corners. Oh yeah, this looks stuff. This stuff looks great. Okay, let's put a little torch in the middle. Keep it lit up. Boom boom. I don't even know. If, we don't even need the wood down there. We're just wasted wood. Oh shit. Oh shit. Look at this fucking guy. He looks like fucking um, Will Smith. Fucking kid and kid and play opening this bitch. Look at his fucking hair. Is that leather armor actually? That oh, looks kind of weird. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Avoid eye contact, just like we do in our in our real social lives. All right, let's get that. Oh yeah, oh, shit. There we go. Okay. So, do we have enough to make a second layer? Probably not. Let's do it as much as we can. Okay, that's as much as we have. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and pop some torches on the walls. And I think what we want to do is make a doorway here all right we have enough room over here now to put some of these now let's go back and get some more cobblestone oh I knew he was around I knew it look at this fucking guy the monsters don't look great in this mod pack they don't look great but you know what the rest of the stuff looks pretty sweet Alright, so we're just going to use this little hole as our 
mining base to start out with. Alright. So I have, uh... You know, whenever you're, you're living the modern lifestyle, right? And... You realize that some things are just mandatory to live that life, even if they seem really lame. And I think the epitome of that is taking pictures of yourself with your phone, otherwise known as selfies. Which I think is a fitting name because the name itself sort of like, whenever you say it, you just know that w even if you didn't know what it meant, you know that it, it is something really lame, right? Um, and it is in, in reality, you know, it is pretty lame. But you have to do it, you know. You live, you live in a Facebook world. Your Facebook is like, it's it's called Facebook, you know. It's got to have your face on it. And people who don't have pictures of themselves on their Facebook, that's immediately a red flag, you know. I mean, I know, I realize that your favorite superhero is Batman, but you should put your fucking face on your Facebook, you know. Not a picture of Batman, because we all know that you're not Batman. Fucking, and if you were Batman, you wouldn't have put a picture of yourself in Batman clothes on your fucking Facebook. It'd be the, the it's probably the opposite of what you would do. You know? It's, don't it's dumb. What was that? It's a huge ass slime. Holy shit. That thing is a giant oh no it's not. It was just the angle. I thought it was bigger than it was. Come on, slime. Come on. Is this a blue one? It's a blue slime? Oh shit. What's up dude? Oh look at this guy. Fucking uh grease or haircut. What's that? Spoils bag. I don't know what this is, but it sounds awesome. Oh yeah, oblivion frame, some tin, some amber, a book. Great, copper, steel, and tin. We got some tin out of that son of a gun. Um, unfortunately, you don't get to keep the bag or anything, but that's pretty cool. I didn't know that was in here. That's new. I've been playing a lot of Hexit and a lot of Galacticraft, which, frankly, I'm loving both of those series. They're just so much fun to do. Um, but some of this stuff is going to be the same, and some of it's different, though, you know? Yeah. Anyway, back to my selfie story. So, sometimes you just get in the mood, you're thinking, man, I'm looking pretty dapper right now. You know, you just got out of the shower, you're looking pretty good, your beard's real nice and shiny and healthy looking. So you're just like, this is the time. This is the time for me to get an updated picture from my FB, my, f my Facebook is what I meant. And uh, so it, I did that, and you know what? I have to say that I look, it looks like I'm taking pictures of young Jesus, like a, 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 a mid to late 20s Jesus before he got all, you know, messiahed up and stuff. Just a, a young, the adventures of young Jesus is what I looked like. And I have to say, if that's the truth, then Jesus is a handsome son of a bitch. Just the handsomest of all sons of bitches. Okay, so where is my thing? There it is. Putting this thing down somewhere. Put in this corner, why not? Okay, so we can't forget one of the key steps that's easy to forget, and that's to get some wool for a bed. Oh, we're getting a bit messages. Must be getting messages about my new, um, my new profile pic, which is me as young Jesus in the bathroom, which, and I'm having a smile on. I'm a smiling, and uh, because I, uh, as young Jesus, I'm super happy to have uh, to exist within the confines of that bathroom at that given moment. I'm just super pumped about it. Okay, so we need more freaking cobblestone. We also need more wood. Okay. We also need... What else do we need, actually? Um, we need to make some stone tools. We need to plant these rubber tree saplings near our house. And you know what? We also I also always forget to get armor. I always forget to make armor, even though it makes life infinitely easier to not die all the fucking time. Okay, so I need to make some more torches real quick. I'm just gonna make one set of four at a time, like an ass. Okay, I'm gonna pump it in this wall. This is how I like to do it. Pop it in the wall. I like to set it on the, the that part. <laughs> eh, alright. 
But yeah, if you guys uh, are really into, you were just really excited about the idea of seeing my face in its current state, then feel free to follow me on Twitter because I post pictures up every once in a while, you know, doing that sort of stuff. And also, I announce all the videos that I post when they're up. I also remind you incessantly to watch them because I'm in I'm in, in a great need for attention. And um, I just talk about random stuff. And I know you guys like to talk about random stuff because that's something that humans, as a species, do. It's called communicating. And I just fucked this up. It's all right though. So we need to, not only do we need to make more cobble for this frickin' wall, which I have to say, it is looking really excellent, but also we need some for our tools, and we might actually have enough to make at least a pickaxe and something else, an axe. Okay. So we need to go get, I'll go ahead and make some more sticks. Look at this. They're different colors because of different stuff. Okay. Um, where is it? Cobble. We'll make a cobble pickaxe. We'll make a, um, a cobble hoe right off the bat because we got a bunch of seeds. So all I did before I started recording was found a little flat space to build the house and I, I mowed the lawn, if you will. So I got a bunch of seeds and I cut down a few trees. Uh, you didn't miss much. Um, a lot of the time, I don't know if you guys know this, there's a little bit of a glimpse behind the scenes. Um, first, while I kill these pigs, because we're going to need some food also, and there's a ton of pigs. You guys are filthy. What have you been doing? It looks like they fucking put... Oh, shit. I'm starving to death. Just as I'm... Okay, I'm going to eat these raspberries. Oh, look at this. They do a half of a fucking leg of meat. How worthless is this? I bet you can make it into like a fruit bowl, which is fucking just sounds a, a delicious. That gives us enough to kill the rest of these pigs and hopefully survive to get a oven up and cook it. Cause you don't want to eat raw meat. That's gross. Nobody likes to eat raw meat, um, other than actually zombies. They like, they like it. Okay. Oh yeah. So anyway, um. Sometimes I will start a recording, right? And I'll, I'll go for even uh, the amount of like a full episode, or even more, like an hour. And then I'll I'll start thinking about everything I'd said before, and during the episode, and be like, that is a whole lot of boring shit. I can definitely talk about more interesting stuff, say more interesting things, do more interesting things. So then I just scrap the entire footage, uh, like 30 minutes to an hour of gameplay. And I redo the whole thing. So actually, I did record me walking around and talking as I cut down a tree or two. But within a five or ten minutes, I was like, "This is this has been boring. I'm going to start over." So at least you guys didn't miss out too much this time. Come here. I'm just like a stickler. I want it to be entertaining at the very least for you guys, even if I'm not doing anything super entertaining. Like right now, I'm killing pigs. You know. You've seen a thousand YouTubers kill pigs in Minecraft, and probably out of Minecraft in real life, you probably have your favorite um, farming channels where they just mutilate pigs and tell you which which shanks of pig meat is the best for cooking, or uh, maybe you just are subscribed to a YouTube channel called Pig Murder Three 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 Two because all the other numbers are uh, are taken. There's a lot of pig killer YouTube channels out there, and he just just this dude murdering pigs for like hours and hours worth of footage. Um, that's that's your thing though, you know. This tree is so huge. Jesus, this is a big ass tree. Okay, so we need to get some some wood to finish our house um, before it gets totally dark. What is this? Is this clay? Oh, I hope it's clay. That would be awesome. It is totally clay. Actually, I don't even know why I want this, but I know at some point we're going to need some, probably. At the very least, we can make some bricks, which is pretty sweet. Who doesn't like who doesn't like bricks? Probably Mario. He's a fucking maniac with the bricks. He's always crushing them and not 
and at some point in his life, he's like, this isn't even enough for me. I hate bricks so much that I need to be even more... I need to do it in a certain way that just says how much I really hate bricks. And so he started just slamming his head into them like a fucking maniac. And now, look, he's a legend for it. He's a lunatic plumber wearing overalls, slamming his face into bricks and uh, breaking them. And uh, we are all saluting him for it because we, as a society, we're fucking uh, worst, uh, you know, human beings. It's terrible. I mean, you know what they say about video games is that uh, we, as a youth, are going to be tainted by these. And the reason that we do all the certain things um, is because we play too many video games. And I have to say, I completely agree because I see it all the time now. I see... It's rampant in the streets with our youth. They're just running around, throwing themselves into brick walls and stuff, breaking the walls with their heads, and then coins come out of them. And it's just, it's a, it's a tragic thing to see, really. It is totally tragic. Um, and the worst part, really, is that they're all wearing these overalls, which, a fashion faux pas, nobody wears overalls. Farmers, you guys have a free pass when it comes to overalls because you know they're like a utility sort of clothing you know if it's for your job then it's cool you can wear the overalls all you want but I mean if it's not for your job and you're just like you know what I really am feeling overalls today uh, ask yourself one question are you gonna leave the house that day and if the answer is yes or even a maybe then just forego the uh, the overalls for that day at the very least, and just wear them around the house, um, because I mean even even around the house you risk being seen like through your window, and nobody wants nobody wants that. It's just uh, life is hard enough without actually having someone see you wearing overalls. And this is coming from a guy that lives in Texas, where it actually 90% of the landscape is actually farms. Um, I, I know what I'm talking about here, guys. Okay, so... I'm gonna go ahead and... F put this here, and see how this... pink eucalyptus wood looks on the corners. Oh yeah, it looks very nice. Looks great. It's white on the outside, but we all will know... that it's actually... pink on the inside where it matters. Okay. So we're gonna put these corners in. I'm going to chop these down. We're going to use these for planks. Put them in the floor, maybe. How's that sound? Does that sound titillating? Yeah, it does. Hell yes, it does. Okay, so... Ooh, we need some dirt. Luckily, I have... What is this? Raw rubber. Oh, I did cut down a rubber tree. Shit. Didn't even realize. Alright, so... One more corner, and then we're good. We're good to go. Now we can make a door? I wonder if we can make different colored doors. Let's type in doors here. Door. Oh shit, look at this. Every single type of wood. Oh, let's make a pink, let's make a pink fucking door. How does that sound? I know it does sound really good. Okay, we need one more set. I don't want to waste all the logs. Who knows what we might need them for. Oh yes, this is actually probably not the door we're going to use. It's one of the untextured doors. So we probably actually just lucked out. What about this white door? Oh, uh, it's one of these? Really? What the fuck? Oh, shit. We're... Oh, jungle wood is... We got spruce planks, right? What about that? Spruce wood door. Wooden door. Um, let's try these, I guess. It's just a wooden door. We don't have any special planks or anything. Alright, we'll just do it. We'll use this as our door. It looks really good, though. The texture pack makes the doors look pretty sweet. Uh, we're out of room. We're going to have to make a chest immediately. Okay, we're going to put this... Oh, yeah, look at that. That is a nice door. That is a nice fucking door. Okay, so immediately we're going to go back to this. We're going to use this worthless Sakura... 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 Uh, planks... On a chest pop pop the fun don't stop okay put the chest down we're gonna make another one I don't know why we didn't make two to begin with come on you dick all 
Alright. Got a double chest. Full on double chest. Alright, so we're gonna put our pink wood up. We're gonna take this out, actually. We're gonna keep those. Put the Sakura wood up. We might actually want those too. Alright, uh, we'll make some uh, torches out of these. We're gonna put the tin up, clay up, oblivion frame up, copper, steel, string, raw rubber. Uh, we'll keep these. Uh, we need to cook these. We got some seeds. That's amber, actually. Uh, we got seeds, cotton seeds, a gelatinous slime ball, perfect, flour, uh, rotten flesh, some books, a uh, pink sapling. Uh, I'll keep that for safekeeping. Everything else looks like we can probably keep it. Uh, barley seeds. Nice. Alright, we'll keep everything else. And we'll start working through the night on some wood and stuff. Is this secure wood? Oh, it's, oh okay, it's good. Alright, so we have three different types of wood here, right? We got this light wood, which is like the oak wood, the normal default wood, okay? We got this really light, uh, sort of a grayish, dull grayish wood, which is um, Sakura wood. And we got this nice deep brown wood called spruce wood from the, from the spruce tree. Um, so the question is, which one do we want to use on the floor? And I was thinking we could um, change it up. Firstly, we'll make ourselves with this ugly wood, some more sticks, and we will make ourselves a shovel, and we'll dig this dirt up. I'm thinking we'll checker it. You guys like that idea? Too bad, bitch. We're doing it anyway. Okay, so we're going to checker it with um, oak, Sakura, oak, we're going to change that there, we're going to change it in a little bit. Secure spruce. Oh, it's oak and spruce. Okay, that makes sense. All right, so then we're gonna go ahead and we're just dig up the whole floor. I'm lagging a little bit here. Okay. The only problem with being um, a representation, a visual representation of of young Jesus, is that my hair keeps getting in my eye, and I keep having to do the Sam Winchester hair flip. Uh, put it behind my ears and stuff. It's not the best situation, to be honest, but you sacrifice it for uh, being hip, as the kids call it. I hope this thing has the furniture uh, mod in it. Let's check. If we can make like a table. Yeah, nice. <laughs> Alright, can we also make carpet? I'm wondering, carpet. No. Rug? Is it a rug? No. So that's a different mod. That's fine. We'll go, we'll go carpetless for now. Okay. So I think that wood must be like, um, that wood there must be like jungle wood or something. It's fine though, it's fine. Okay. I'm just gonna fill this baby in with this stuff. Not gonna have even close to enough, to be honest. There we go. Okay. And then we'll put this there. Oh, that's wrong wood. Wrong wood. It's the ugly wood. We're going to have to go find another spruce tree. And we'll fill this in first. Alright, so we got a lot of wood. Great. This is awesome. That's looking good, I think. Look at it. Looks great so far. So I think in the morning, we're going to kill this freaking uh, oncoming tr oncoming spider. Oh, look at him. He's trying to Navy SEAL me. Trying to SEAL his team 6 me, but he doesn't even know. He doesn't even know. Okay, so like I was saying, in the morning, we're going to go sheep hunting. We're going to kill some sheep for their wool, get a bed going so we don't have to go through the, sit through the nights like this. But the map, look at the map, though. Let's take a look at this map. Can I not open the map? Surely. I can open the map. What's a button on there? What's the button? What's the button? There's not a button for this. There's not a button. Okay, I've used all of the buttons. There isn't one. We'll have to figure that out later. This this is gonna bug me. Okay. So we'll put these torches up symmetrically. This one's gonna go right here. 
Yeah, that's perfect. That is perfect. Perf. Perf. Let's put that one there. That one looks weird, actually. It's fine. This is fine. Fine the way it is. Okay, so what can we do with this wood? What can we do with this wood? Can we make a table with this wood, maybe? Maybe? How do you make a table? Oh, come on. Alright. Some slabs and some wood planks. Slabs and wood planks. Alright. Is that how you make a slab? Yes. Slabs. Planks. Oh, is that not... Is that right? It's right, but I guess secure wood is not happening here. Uh, that's unfortunate. So really, this, this secure wood is just absolutely fucking worthless so far. I'm just going to put it up. I'm just going to use it as a... Uh, some... Oh, look, it's daytime. Alright, it is daytime. Now, officially, he's on fire. That marks the beginning of the day. The first thing we need to do, before we go hunting for sheeps, is we need to get at least eight cobblestone. Wait, where is the stone one? Stone hoe, stone pickaxe. There we go. Eight. We'll go ahead and mine this too. So what this is? Copper? Copper ore. Alright, so let's go make an oven. We'll cook the pig meat. Cook this pork up. Gather some of these raspberries. It's going to be the best. We're going to eat this for, for breakfast. And it's going to be amazing. Okay? Okay. Put this in this corner here. Use that ugly Sakura wood. Alright, let's put this meat in there. And once this is done, we'll grab it out of the oven and we'll go hunting. Okay, so we have nine cooked pork chops. That's good enough. Okay, and we've got... While we're on our, while we're outside, we'll go ahead and plant these rubber trees somewhere. Put it over here. Clear out some of these. Is that two? One, two. There we go. We got all three of our rubber saplings set up, ready to go. Now we're going to go on an adventure, an epic adventure, after we eat this pork. Oh. Don't want to waste that pork chop on about half a heart. Well, let me eat this raspberry. Alright, that's fine. We're, we're clicking up on health, it's okay. Look at these lovely roses. Oh, yes. Taking them, taking them. But these are somewhere in our house. While we're out, we'll go ahead and chop some trees down too, because we're running low on the good wood. This looks like oak. Are we using oak? Yeah, we're using oak for our floor. I'm really kind of tempted to install the tree capitator mod, to be honest. But I'm, I probably won't. I probably won't. We'll go pure on this. We'll go pure. Like I like my women, I like them pure blooded. Pure blooded, completely pure. Don't like him to have dirty blood. Of course, I'm talking about meth. I don't want any meth in their blood. You guys probably thought I was going into like some sort of race war mode, but I'm not. I just don't want to be hooked on meth. That's it. Oh, mm, look at this. Uh, we should not get distracted. That is not what we came to do, okay? Oak wood is what we got. We got some oak wood and some rubber wood. This is a rubber tree. This is a fucking rubber tree. Didn't even notice. Oh, I fell into the water. Oh, shit. This adventure is going horribly. Okay. Let's move on. Oh, look at this. Majestic. Killing you for your wool. 
Ash, he ain't no fool. Okay, so we are we broke our sword already, Jesus. Let's just use uh, our fists on the next one. Let's use the fists of fury on this little shit. Okay, we got two wool. All we need is a thing to drop one. Come here. We got four, three, two, and one, and dead. Oh yeah, we got wool going on. So as you can see, they have added, since I've played, the damage indicator mod. Which is nice. But I don't think they have the more food mod. It's unfortunate. I like to eat everything. I want to be able to eat the sheep's meat, not just get its wool for my uh, new coat. You know? I mean, a new coat is always a good thing. I like to get new coats. Every winter, you got to get yourself a new coat. Treat yourself to a brand new coat. Keep the winter out. Let's make a fucking bed before I get into something weird. All right, let's see. we got to make some of this into wood planks. Got to make this into some wool. Oh, yeah. Can you make different color beds? No. Why hasn't somebody come up with a mod that makes the bed the same color as the wool you used? Why isn't that a thing? It probably is a thing, isn't it? I'm sure it is a thing. Look at this bed. I love it. I like the straight lines across. Very symmetrical. It speaks to the graphic designer in me. Okay, so let's go ahead and finish the wood, the oak part of the floors. Okay. Now all we have to do is get the spruce wood. We can put our oak wood up. We need to build a freaking roof. I just realized we don't have a roof on this house yet. But it's fine. It's, it's fine, okay? Okay, so what else do we need to do? We need to... What the hell were we going to do, actually? Um, we can start a little farm here. That's a good idea, while we're thinking about it. Make a little farm. Actually, just make it, like, right here. Around the edge of the house. We need to put some water, of course. Actually, we'll make our first farm right over here. What's up, dude? Didn't even see you there. I'm not going to murder you. Look at those eyes. Those are freaking adorable eyes. Can't, can't murder that guy yet. <laughs> yet? Murder him later. Oh, you're not going to fall into my hole, you little shit. Jesus. There's literally one hole. I, I'm going to fill this in. Alright, move, dude. What are you doing? It's going nuts over here. Okay, so I'm going to have to ask you to get to vacate the premises. So I'm making a farm here, okay? Uh, we got some barley seeds. We'll use that for shoe. Because barley is the same as wheat. And we'll dig another row. We'll use that for cotton. Why not? Because we could have actually grown this into cotton, wool, and stuff. You little fuck! Are you serious? I wasn't gonna kill you, but now you're fucking dead. Domestic violence all over you. Beating the shit out of you with some cotton seeds. How does that make you feel? Hopefully it makes you feel awful. Because you're an awful fucking person. Sorry. You guys had to witness my rage. He jumped right onto my fucking crop. What an asshole.